Where are you guys? It's Yvonne. It's a little windy today. I'm at the Goodwill. Let's go in and see what we can find to resell for a profit. Or just for ourselves to save a little money. Yeah, look at this mess. Ow. Okay, whatever. Let's get to work. So this location is taking a whole front area and kind of try to make it look boutique-y. Like a bridal area too sometimes. Yes. Today they have beach and formals. And these purses. Now this is... It does look like a vintage purse, but I feel like that's an upcycle job. I feel like a designer wouldn't have done that purpose. This is the way this fringe comes on the rolls. I feel like they would have hidden it, right? All cashiers to the front, please. Cashiers that one's a hot mess. It's new, anyways. But don't worry, because guess what? We're going to get this vintage one. Yes. $8.99. Looks like it's in good shape, too. We'll definitely get that. Oh, and a scarf for me. Gorgeous. Well, have you ever wanted to design your own mug? There you go. <laughs> Plenty of blanks. Hard goods. Oh, I think I see some things. Let's start here, though. I think I looked at this. This is not a Pierce. Sticker says circle wear. But wait. Uh, are you a John Roya or John Raya? $8.99? Or Beastie's Lion. So made in China. That's an older made in China sticker. And yes, there's a barcode. Barcodes have been around since the 70s. And you're awesome. Doors of Dublin. $8.99. Six place mats. Ha! Huh. You guys remember in the 80s and 90s when those door posters were all the rage? You could get them of like major cities. Those are kind of cool, but I think I'll pass. <laughs> Letters. Those are ceramic, not milk glass. Resin birdie. Religious fountain thing I do. Before five, after five. Okay, that's funny. Coffee, wine. Coffee, coffee. Some black amethyst glass. I can see the silver's already coming off. Vacation item. Probably worth a little bit extra. Lots of laser. How much is this one though? Seven nine nine. Yeah, better not. I know it's a Statue of Liberty, but I better not. That's a lot. <laughs> well, there's a pumpkin for you. Mole or mole on it? Sartouche. How much is that? Four ninety nine. Thirty percent off. Ah, it's almost. Is this it's not? Not quite. Some more laser glass. $7.99 is kind of a lot for that though, you guys, as far as resale. This might be a Hager. Not sure. Napkin rings. I love the box. Oh, I think I see something. Now we're talking. $5.99 for an Italian vase. Thank you very much. We'll take it. <laughs> There's something nice. Four ninety nine. We'll take that. Beautiful purple color. Let's see what this one is. That looks like hand poured glass too. Hobbyist piece. Haha. <laughs> There's a frog for you, Mom. They just rolled out a fresh cart. We can't look at it yet. We have to wait for him to put it out. I've had one of these before in the box. It's pretty cute, though, right? I'm going to take it over and see if it'll clean up. Let's see what we have for candle holders. 
Christmas tree. That no, that's not what I thought it was. Oh, wait a minute. There's a clear Franciscan Moderna. It's just one. Oh, that's a lot of dishwater haze, though. Okay, that's really a glass, but I guess you could use it for a votive. to clear with angels but it's this now I know that's modern but look there's the saving grace look at that holder it's on it's not acrylic either it's glass look at the blue and the purple I don't even know how much that is yet but I'm pretty sure that's a yes another area where they're trying to curate things you know and make it look more boutique when you come in <laughs> I don't know why they don't pick a lane like really just do what you do this is so cool. Still new too. Twenty dollars. Actually, there's still a little bit of room left on this. That is so great. I'm sure someone will buy you. Um, someone that's shopping for themselves will definitely get you. Awesome. Okay, I'm in bases now. There's a lot of pretty stuff. Most all of it's like home goods but if it's exceptionally pretty and the price is low enough where I just put it in the booth I'm okay with that that's so beachy looking that's really pretty but I have seen those at home goods I am gonna get this studio piece yeah that's interesting enough. Oh darn. Sorry, hang on. I found that. <laughs> yes, I did. Everything else is definitely floral, floral. Alright, let's move on. I did move on down that road to look at salt and pepper shakers, but he was putting up pots and pans, so I just grabbed these two and come over here. Those are some kind of celluloid. Those are so cute. Yeah, those are very old. These are the winners of my mind. <laughs> There's one in every family. <laughs> these shakers. I'm not sure about these. A little bit of damage on them. Those are pretty darn old. I did take a good look at mugs and one for myself. It's got Rita, Ruth, and Michelle. Definitely love that one. When I was looking at all these glasses, I found the matching glasses to this. So they're in the cart. And I'm going to get this Lucite with the shells and a nice orange. $3.99. Love it. It does say San Francisco in the middle of it, but I can't really tell. Oh, and I have an update. Guess what? I told you guys at the last video I was going to teach myself about Waterford Crystal because Jeremy and Michael find so much of it, it's inspiring to me. Try to learn the patterns. But I did pick up two Ralph Lauren low balls or old fashioned Muppets in Space. Oh my gosh. And I listed them and they already sold. I really like this one, Muppets in Space. But, a lot of dishwater haze. But yeah, they already sold. Like overnight. That's fantastic. Look. $88 for two of them. Woo. So yeah, I'm definitely going to teach myself a little bit more about some of the crystal barware. Those people like to be fancy with their whiskey glasses or whatever. Like to impress their guests. Oh, wait a minute. As I was coming back over here the second round, I saw this in the clothing. It's only $1.99. It's a balloon festival shirt. It's hit on the front and the back. And then for myself, another one of those sheer shirts. Remember last year I bought like every one I could find. I love them. 
you do have to kind of wear a tank top or double them up. It's 30% off too. But they don't last very long because it's real sheer thin material. Alright, I am super happy with everything. Yeah, this was a good little pop-in trip. Alright, you guys. I hope you had a little bit of fun. And I'll see you on the next video.